Oh, we got a bunch of birdies down here on the side of the path just before the truck. I think at least three, maybe more hiding behind the pole. See how close I can get to them before they fly off. There's actually four. They're coming this way because there's somebody walking the other way. They have to fly off here. What are they? Ibises. Those two that way and two that way. They'll meet up. Or they're going to meet up in the same tree. Well, this camera's. This is the last of the Chinese GoPro knockoffs. All them birdies are up in the tree. They all. Well, there's three of them up there. That lady that was walking this way. We had a nice chat about birds. She likes watching the birds too. I don't know what the city people are doing down here. They got weed eaters and stuff. So we're going to walk. We're going to get in a nice long walk today because it's supposed to start raining tonight and rain tomorrow. I knew we got a little bit of rain last night, but I didn't think it was that much. That's still a lake down through there. How to walk with a dog with good hearing. You don't. <laughs> we just stop. I don't see nothing across the creek. Nothing. But she hears something. There's nothing over there. Oh, no. Nope. She's gone into her stalk mode. I don't see anything. I don't see any movement. I hear the birds. That's it. Nothing over there. But we're stopped. We're just standing here. This is not good for my walking. It stimulates the doggy brain, though. <laughs> uh, whatever it is, she hasn't stopped. It's hard to see. There are dozens of these little birds. There goes one right there. There just there goes another one. They're all over these, down low, up high. Just sit here and watch, they all fly around. Kind of swampy back in there. And they're all down in the ground, flying down low, up high. Dozens of them. Well, we're almost at the halfway point. And we'll turn around. What about those little sparrows? There's a whole flock of them in here. I saw a bigger bird back there. You can see where the branch is moving. One just landed on that. There's one there. They're everywhere. There goes another one. There's a pretty good swampy area in there. Goes far down there as I can see. Back up through there, all the way back up into the woods way up in there. It's got a kind of a scum on it, so it looks like first I thought it was some kind of a tarp laid out in there, but it's just scummy water, all swampy. I wonder when the deer are running through there, do they step in that and go, oh, got my feet wet. <laughs> well, there's our white sign down there on the pole. That's our halfway point, a little over a mile. We'll turn around and head back. Why don't you walk farther than two miles every day? Because this one finds stuff on the ground to smell and we stand around for 10 minutes at a time while she investigates. I'm barely moving and that's the way we've been doing it now for the last 50 yards. That swamp even down here, off down in through there, all off through there. This little camera may not show it real well, but all wet, gunky water. Uh, 
Okay, now we're actually at a very slow pace back on the path. Well, when that truck drives by, you can sure smell the diesel fumes from the exhaust. Okay. I don't even know. It's uh, Wednesday. I'm uh, going to call this a done deal. I'm not going to try and film the birdies when we, when we go back by because we've already seen them. So have a good day. Bye. Two egrets. Those are not the group of five that were down here earlier.